Lucas Media. So we got some news coming out of the federal government, and that is former President Donald J. Trump has been convicted on multiple charges. Now, according to New York Times, it says that Donald Trump was convicted on 34 felony counts of falsifying business records in a case stemming from payment of silence. I'll say adult star. I think it was Stormy Daniels. So he got hit in New York with 34 counts or he found he was found guilty of 34 counts. If y'all remember a couple years ago, he had to turn himself in for that and the Atlanta thing down here in Georgia, all of that good stuff, right? Well, now that he's been convicted, what's going to happen? Probably nothing. Um, Donald Trump's already promised to, to do his appeal. That can take a long time. Um, I know the election year is coming up, and I believe if he's elected, everything else got to be held off. Now, I don't see it's, it's with a, a federal. He's facing federal time. Because if he was, then he would technically, he could technically pardon himself, but that would be a good, a bad look. And yeah, the country might go up after that. But I do think that the appeal, once he get the, once they get to play around with them, with them appeals, he'll still be able to run and there's a good chance he'll probably get in the office. But yeah, but you know, they're trying to come at him hard because they don't want him to be back in office. All these different states and you know, some people say it's a witch hunt. I don't really know. You know, I, I just I just know right now somebody gotta come in and fix us because we in bad shape. But I just want to get my quick thoughts about it. Tell me what y'all think.